going on? Um, I feel bad because I'm like the only black guy on this show, so it's supposed to be like the black section of comedy, but I'm an anime <laughs> champion. Uh, <laughs> I do anime jokes, so it's not gonna be that black. It's gonna be black in name, gonna, you know, for the struggle. Um, one of the problems <laughs> as a black man that I have is that I speak very proper English, and you guys don't understand the disrespect that comes to a black man that speaks proper English. It's, um, let me explain to you. When I talk to other black people, they look at me like, this nigga think he better than us. And then when I, <laughs> when I talk around white people, they look at me like, this nigga think he's better than us. They call me a nigga <laughs> in my face. They're not, they're not even afraid, okay? Um, my, my baby mama, she's Asian. And in that case, um, when her Asian friends saw me, they were just like, cool, we got a black guy. Yeah, woo. And then um, I started speaking. And they just lost all cope in me being a cool black guy. Um, I have to find out what WAP mean. I don't know if you guys have heard this. Uh, uh, I'm so not black. I had to look this up. And when I found it out, I, um, excuse me for a moment. It sounds like uh, a wet ass pussy. And I was just. <laughs> I just, um, at this point with this heat wave, I feel like I have WAP at this point. I'm sitting there. <laughs> uh, I told somebody else, like, as a black guy and as a nerd, I have issues. Let me explain this. Have you guys ever heard of um, PDE? It's a big dick energy. Um, <laughs> celebrate this. And I don't understand why they celebrate this. As a black man with big dick, it's not cool. Um, I have a lot of issues. Uh, for example, if I go to a public restaurant, a restroom, and I sit down on the toilet, splash, my dick is in the water. It's like homeboy <laughs> said. I need a new dick. It is, I need to desensitize. I'm there with all the just like, it's not as bad. Um, furthermore, women don't even like big dicks. I've had several women tap out in the middle. They're in the corner talking <laughs> to their ring manager. Uh, they throw a towel at me, and they're like, I'm not coming out. And I look at them like this is Rocky IV. Uh, my dick is Ivan Drago. Your pussy is Apollo Creed. If it dies, it dies. Get back in the <laughs> I'm a Dragon Ball Z fan, so I'm like, throw the pussy a Senzu bean. I got some Dragon Balls. <laughs> back. Come on. Um, <laughs> um, as a black man that's a nerd, I, I, I hate the fact that people always try and make me cool. They're just like, come on, Marcellus. You could do this. You could do that. I have a cousin from Watts that bought me some Beat by Dre's because um, he thought that would make me blacker. It ruined my life. Um, I, I don't know. If you guys ever, because Beat by Dre's are studio quality, okay? Have you ever listened to porn in studio quality? Mm, it's, it's like, it'll ruin. That's WAP right there. You can hear the wetness. Like, <laughs> it ruined me. I can't masturbate to regular sound anymore. I need studio quality sound to come. This is bad, okay? <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, I feel kind of old, I have a five-year-old, if you can tell, because I, uh, I, I look cool when I'm doing this, but as soon as the bitch is taller than me, it's all bad. Um, <laughs> so I call it old. Let's see. Um, my last one, my last one, I'm going to go here, okay? My last one is uh, FBD, okay? And I know you guys aren't familiar with this one. This is first black dick. And I don't like this because in me at times when I'm having sex, I have a, a, people always ask me, Marcellus, why don't you mess around with black girls? I don't know who my father is. So I'm always afraid I'm gonna wind up messing around with my sister. I saw Star Wars, Leia kiss Luke and it blew my mind. Um, <laughs> so I've always been afraid of that. So that's why I messed with other cultures of women. And um, I hear this a lot when I'm there, I'm messing around with this girl. She's like, you're the first black dick that I had. And um, there's a lot of stress. There's a lot of just pressure. Excuse me, my voice does that sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of pressure that I don't need. I, have a, I feel like I have all the black men on my shoulders at this point. And if I disappoint, if I disappoint I'm just messing up a stereotype. She's going to go tell all her friends it's not true. And I don't need that. I don't. Um, I like my, my son, he's a hybrid. He's half Chinese. Um, I have issues with my in-laws, like my Chinese mom. We don't see eye to eye on some things. Uh, yesterday, I came home from a show and she was washing her car at 2 a.m. I come from the hood. If you're washing your car at 2 a.m., you're trying to get away from CSI. Who did you hit, Chinese mom? I don't understand. 
Um, she got mad at me, and I she be just doing a little slick shit. You know what I'm saying? Like when I'm walking by, she just give a little quick jab and whatnot, right? Like I was walking through the kitchen yesterday, and she's watching a documentary about Kevin Hart, and she was like, "Marcella, yeah. how is Kevin Hart such a bigger comedian than you, and you so much taller than him?" And then she just went <laughs> to the TV, and I'm like, "Mom, it don't work like that. Cause I'm taller, it won't make me a bigger comedian than Kevin Hart." Um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna leave you on this. I came downstairs one time and she was watching New Jack City. I don't know if you guys ever seen New Jack City. It was that he's shaking his head. It was at the part where Pookie was smoking crack and she just looked up at me and and I thought <laughs> that she was judging me. <laughs> and I was like, look, I smoke a little marijuana from time to time. Excuse me, my voice is doing that again. And I don't know if she's judging me. Okay, that's my time. Thank you very much. My <laughs>